damn so-called in, in, in a damn band. I think it's that band right over there. He taking, he blowing for a damn dog in the damn streets. Just now, just back there, just now. Uh, like, how's... And a human, a black, so-called black person, they'd have kept going. They wouldn't have, nearby wouldn't have done that. Yeah. But uh, anyway, this is what I want to talk about. Uh, this is what I want to talk about. Uh, what is this I want to talk about? Uh, they got this elderly woman. Tells this young man. Oh. Uh, he needed to like make money and as soon as like they uncle they undercover uncle Tom's yeah they undercover uncle Tom's and they act like they actually for their people like they'll say things like the way they treat so-called black people our people they'll say that but in the same breath when she hear that younger guy that dude saying like Esau treat our people unjustly she'll say things like is that on YouTube and the young man will be like yeah boy you gonna hinder yourself from money this and that and the third you making yourself look stupid and he was like wait a minute how in the hell is I'm looking stupid when I'm sitting up here loving my people and yeah I look I rather look he said I would rather look crazy for my people than to look stupid talking against my people. Did that hit a nerve? Nope. Like you in so many you you are under you 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 exposing yourself. Oh she ex, he told her, you exposing yourself. You exposing yourself as a as an undercover Uncle Tom. That's really what it is. I said, no, no, excuse me. And then I like what he also told her. He told her, he said, well, you hindering yourself from making money, but he said at the same time, they making money off of George, George Floyd. They probably gave him a paid vacation after he did that. I said, you, that, no, excuse me. He, he, I like what he told her. He said, you ain't saying that. He told her, he said, you ain't saying nothing about that. But you, sitting up here he told he said but you sitting up here telling me that's what he told her you sitting up here telling me that i'm hindering my pockets which is the same thing i would i, I would say you you see what i'm saying is it worth that that that's that's sacrificing your people because did the bible say it's better to be in the house of of mourning than to be in the house of mirth in the house of feasting didn't the bible say that meaning that feasting means you choosing to suffer with your people that's what moses did didn't didn't moses do that the bible says that moses chooses to suffer with his people and i'm gonna find i'm gonna put that scripture in the description box he chose to suffer with his people than to enjoy the pleasures of sin for a season Moses didn't worry about stuff like that. You see what I'm saying? Because God still took care of him. So then they got this dude telling his uncle that he wasn't a slave. I'm like, when I heard that, the first thing came to my mind was, did he download a damn virus in his damn brain or what did he do? What the fuck did he download in his damn brain? To tell his uncle, he disrespected his whole uncle's legacy. His uncle lost his baby brother. His, that was my cousin in that uh, bus that blew at me. I said, he disrespected his uncle, his uncle's whole struggle legacy. His uncle was in Christianity. I mean, he didn't know. You can't hold something. That's like trying to hold your uncle to something that he didn't responsible for something that he didn't know if he didn't know the knowledge that he have now compared to back then his 
his nephew didn't even give him credit for like you know what i shouldn't have never said that that you wasn't a slave because you still got to pay for all of us is still subject to paying things him he didn't have sense enough to tell his nephew that you know what i mean and his nephew disagrees with everything that his uncle he disagrees with everything his uncle say he don't want to his uncle, I mean, his nephew don't want to hear nothing about the Bible, all this kind of shit. I'm like, man, that is totally insane. It's like he went into, he went or wherever he went, Miller so-and-so, or uh, Trump or Terry or whatever. I don't know, man. It looked like he just a, your mind is, I don't know what's wrong with you. You, you went at your uncle like that, your mind fucked up. Like, I mean, he might be smart and all. He might be. He may have a good education ahead on the show, cause he done went across the world. He done learned. You know what I mean? But what he's doing, he's taking the information that he learned and he's trying to manipulate his manipulate, using it to his advantage to manipulate his uncle, because he got all this knowledge. He want to take and twist it and manipulate everything. But. His, the same struggle that he came up in, his uncle is the one that kept pulling through with that struggle, giving him them, them struggle beans and rice, cabbages and stuff, what, all this stuff. If it wasn't for his uncle bringing him, pulling him through, he wouldn't be where he at right now. But I guess you done got a couple of chunks of money on his shoulder. I guess he done gotten high-minded, you know? Ain't no way in the world I could have fixed my mouth to tell my uncle some shit like that after my uncle done struggle and living in a world where he being racially profiled and all that kind of stuff and then gonna say he wasn't never a slave. Man, you better, you, I think you owe your uncle an apology for saying that shit. I don't know what, what, where that information come from. Uh, it just sounds like to me you going insane, homeboy. Something wrong, something ain't right. I'm gonna say it again, I'm gonna keep saying, it. you must be the downloaded a damn virus in your damn brain or something. You need to uninstall that shit. I don't understand, I, I'm, I'm still trying to, I'm trying to pull in hair out my head, trying to find out where in the hell did that, that where's you getting that information from to tell your uncle that? I'm like, what? Like, I don't get it. You gotta, you gotta, um, I mean, I, I don't see how you can, fix your mouth to let that exit your mouth. I think you need to think, he need to think before he speak, you know? That's crazy. You mean to tell me I did eight minutes, it's gonna take me a long damn time to upload this shit. But uh, I'm gonna see y'all later, man. I'm up out of here. All right. Much love to my people, you know? All right, I'm gonna see y'all later here, I'm out.